Good morning, Barstow, and welcome to this episode of BTVN. I'm Grant Zahorsky. And je m'appelle Libby Roar. We'll be right back after the intro. Yo, listen up, here's the story about a little guy that lives in the blue world. And all day and all night and everything he sees is just blue. Like him, inside and outside. Blue his house with the blue little window and a blue cornbread. And everything is blue for him and himself and everybody around. Cause he ain't got nobody to listen. As you may have noticed from the decorations in the senior hallway, this week is National French Week, and French Club has a lot in store for us. Nutella and Go and French Biscuits will be sold in the bookstore all week. Today, look out for Tarte Pomme at lunch, and on Friday, the club will be hosting a movie night from 6.30 to 8.30. Lastly, if you know the answer to this trivia question, email Mademoiselle Ivrard to win a Nutella surprise. In what year did France win the World Cup? If you know, email Mademoiselle Ivrard. Hey Libby, did you make it out to the soccer game on Saturday? I did. I can't believe you won. That's amazing. After winning Saturday's game, we are now headed to state. There will be buses headed out to Blue Springs so that the upper school can support our team this Friday, November 14th. We will likely leave campus at 11 o'clock and should be back on campus at 2.45. Go Knights! I hear our cross-country team was at state too. Congratulations to Michelle Martin and Lauren Hendrickson for qualifying. Michelle finished in 23 minutes and 20 seconds, putting her in 95th place, and Lauren finished in 22 minutes and 34 seconds, earning her 67th place out of 160 runners. That's amazing. Congratulations to all our athletes on great seasons. We'd also like to applaud junior Alexa Burt, who performed in the National Youth Honors Orchestra at the NAFME convention in Nashville this past week. If you pass her in the hall, make sure to congratulate her on her fantastic achievement. With all this congratulating, we have a few thank yous to share as well in celebration of even more Barstow's success. First off, Barstow Pizza Hut Night was a great success with a total of $1,807.54 in sales. Barstow received $361.51, so we'd like to thank everyone who stepped up and bought a slice. The lower school box top contest did really well too. The, linen, the winning class was Mrs. Romano's fourth grade with 691 box tops. In total, they collected 6,150 box tops, giving Barstow $615. Please continue to click box tops and put it in the front desk um, at the basket or the lower school office. Finally, Barstow and Rainy Day Books would like to thank everyone who took part in our lower school book fair. Your contributions allowed us to continue to update our lower school library to make it the best it can be. Wow, what an awesome few months for Barstow. In other news, we have several speakers uh, coming up in the next few months. First of which is Jamie Metzl, a Barstow alum, coming to talk at Unity Temple about his new book, The Genesis Code, tonight. To purchase tickets, go to rainydaybooks.com. This upcoming Saturday will be the TEDx Youth Event at the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art from 1 to 5 p.m. Tickets are only $6 and are on sale at the Nelson's website. Finally, Mr. Byer, one of our own middle school teachers, um, will be giving a lecture from 7 to 9 at, on Wednesday, December 3rd. His lecture will, is titled, Seven Ways a Black Hole Can Kill You. It should be an exciting night. <laughs> I can't wait. It should be an awesome event. Now let's shift gears and head to Shea Rush with this week's weather. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Shay Rush, and I'm going to try and do this week's weather in French. Aujourd'hui, nous sommes à 68 dans a. No, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. Ah. I'm going to make the weather today. <laughs> Donc, lundi, il fera assez beau aujourd'hui. Le soleil sera un peu présent, mais en fin de journée, il fera très, très froid. Monday, it's going to be nice. It's going to be partly cloudy. And it's going to be a, a pretty good day. Mm -hmm. Demain, la plus belle journée, il va faire assez bon, mais très, très froid le soir encore une fois, et le soleil sera présent. Tomorrow, it's going to be a bluebird, but uh, it's going to get pretty chilly in the evening. Sure. Mercredi, il va faire encore très, très froid comme toute la semaine, et les nuages seront présents en fin de journée. Um, Wednesday, it's going to be... Cold all day, partly cloudy skies, and uh, a low in the 20s. Jeudi, encore froid, comme d'habitude, mais le soleil sera encore un peu présent le matin. Uh, Thursday, you're going to see some more partly cloudy skies, and a low all the way down in the teens. 
Et vendredi, la journée la plus importante de la semaine, match de soccer pour Barstow. Donc pas de pas d'école. No school. Very important. Friday, it's going to be a great day. We're going to have very little school due to the boys semi state semi game. Super excited, yeah. but it is going to be very cold. So okay. bundle up ladies and gentlemen. Et ce week-end, on aura peut-être de la neige. Oui, and on the weekend, we might see our first flakes of the year. I'm excited. Maybe even Me some too. accumulation. Um, expect that on Saturday. It's going to be a pretty cool deal. And uh, that's your weather. I'm Shay Rush. Je suis Paul Robert. Bonne journée, Barstow. Have a good French week. Thank you, Shay and Paul Louis. For those of you still looking for opportunities to enhance your growth as a person, look out for Ms. Zimmerman's email about Youth Volunteer Corps. They're a really cool organization and they bring teenagers together to make a difference in our city. Take a look to see if any of the upcoming projects interest you. This Wednesday are auditions for the new Barstow Pretenders Club play, Sorry, Wrong Number. Please uh, see Lizzie Mombello for more information. On a final scheduling note, tomorrow we will have our Veterans Day Assembly, and on Wednesday we will have National Honor Society inductions. This will mean no BTVN for until Friday. All NH me members need to be in the auditorium at 7.30 in the morning for rehearsal tomorrow. Remember to email Mademoiselle Ivard if you know what year France won the World Cup. That's all we have today, Barstow. I'm Grant Zahorski. And I'm Libby Rohr. A tout à l'heure, Barstow. <laughs>